what is going on guys before we get into the pkp video i did want to talk about a couple things first off today i did a podcast the chicken and battlefield podcast their link will be in the description if you enjoy battlefield talk go ahead and listen to that great people i definitely recommend it it's a lot of uh, battlefield 4 talk although right now a little bit of 2042 but mostly battlefield 4 and of course chicken so before we move on to the video, I just wanted to pause and say the episode that I was in on the Chicken and Battlefield podcast is live right now on Spotify. If you'd like to go listen to that, and I highly recommend it if you're a Battlefield fan, the link for that will be in the description. Anyway, let's get on with it. But on another note, I want to say thank you all for the amazing support on the channel. Going into Battlefield 2042, I didn't think my videos would even get over 50. Prior to Battlefield 2042, I might have hit 30 on a couple, so I do appreciate that. And if you are a new viewer or a returning viewer and you enjoy Battlefield, go ahead and subscribe. We're going to be doing Battlefield content for quite a while, it seems like. Anyways, at the end of the video, I'm going to show my class setup. I'm not going to talk over it. Uh, the class for the PKP is very simple. It is a super strong gun. I definitely recommend it if you're having trouble getting the Apex Predator title because I feel like 42 kills is super easy with this thing. You just put yourself in the correct position. And it's just the easiest gun to use in this game. And it needs to be fixed immediately. But we all know that's not going to happen. But I am trying to get the entire Battlefield player base subscribed to the channel. Currently we are 238 out of 7,000. So if you're one of those people that aren't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe down below. Anyways, later.
decided to talk over this portion. Uh, the PKP setup super simple. I have the champion muzzle brake. I rarely ever use any other attachments uh, on this. I never switch it up except for if I'm out of ammo. But I think the PKP pairs well with McKay. I use C5 to you know blow up vehicles since they are the biggest issue in this game currently. And then the proximity sensor. I don't use this to spot anymore. You can actually throw it straight up in the air and grapple to it. Um, it's pretty crazy. I don't have any clips that I will share with it because I haven't done really much anything with the PKP with it, but it is pretty useful sometimes. So anyway, that's the PKP setup. Very simple. I did get it mastery as well, so really easy. Any other thing that I would use would be these. Although the game's not super specific on the difference between these two, as it just says plus two accuracy and vertical recoil control. Um, I wish there's a little more transparency if those are different. But anyways, that's it. A whole bunch of scopes you can use. Things shoot super straight. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Later.